Welcome to No Rules Show. It's your boy Spitz Gonzalez in the house. We have Lumos downstairs. I know why he come. I'll tell her later though. Uh, we just definitely building. we're keeping him down there, yeah. Of course, we're keeping him down there, man. Hmm. He can't just come without telling me, you know, he's coming to trade trade Bitcoin on my well, Wi-Fi. Try, yeah, well, and try to trade something else as well. Big up DFR in the building as well. Vaccine gang. <laughs> Felix, I miss you, bro. But we got a special guest today, man. And that's what I like about no rules. You just don't know who I'm going to bring out. Big radio personality, good friend of mine, a women's champion, <laughs> Snoochie Shy in the hey, building. Hey, come on, women's champion. I'm here for it. I'm here of for course. it. Of course. Do you know what? You are the third uh, female guest we've had on, isn't it? We've had. Yeah, you're yeah. counting now. He's yeah. counting. He's counting. Yeah, we've yeah. 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 only had three. You have a third. That's not yeah, like an, a special number. Yeah, but I want to I I this year really raise that. Okay. Snoochie, I want you to just keep coming back. All right, I'll keep coming. <laughs> yeah, we'll take it to like 100. So if you keep inviting me, I'll keep coming. I've seen Magnums out there as well, so... Well, we've got I'm the there. whole supply. Oh, yeah. Magnums and filthy fellas are cousins, I'll tell you that. Mm. The Magnums, I've always got my water. Do they really water. bang in the winter, Magnums, though? Yeah. You can even mm. put it in the microwave. Actually, you've got, your cat's called Magnum. Yeah, my yeah. cat's called Magnum. It's just oh, you've got specs. a cat? Yeah. You should have bought your cat, Snoochie! I don't think so. <laughs> no. He might have started attacking people. He's a bit like a dog. He don't like no one except for me and a little bit of my mum. No, he'll like me because I used to have a he dog. He won't. <laughs> you sure? <laughs> I'm telling you, he won't. Magnum's a fun... I've seen Magnum on Instagram. That's a funny cat. Yeah. Is it? What colour? He's, he's wild. He looks like Postman Pat's cat, just black and white. Oh, mm. Postman Pat? Yeah. Legend. Is he still with us? I'd imagine so. Postman Who did the voice of Postman Pat? It was somebody. Okay, carry oh, find on. out. Let's carry find, on. find out. On. Find out. Please. Find out. Find out, man. Find out. out. Okay. How's things, Stucci, man? Well, everything's good, you know. Everything's cool. Obviously, lockdown and that. <sighs> Tearful, but we're here. Um, but yeah, this is like I'm, my outing. I'm struggling, man, with this this lockdown stuff. Like, yeah. I'm I'm I'm. I've, I was telling Tigo earlier. I'm trying to like. I want to cancel. Zoom as a company. Oh my god! I want to cancel it. Do you know what? Big up to Zoom because they've made bare money. Mm. But I'm so over Zoom. You know when people are just like, let's Zoom. And I feel like yeah, mm. because of lockdown, more people want to Zoom. Like they yeah. wouldn't have Zoomed you before or yeah, FaceTimed yeah, yeah, you, yeah. but now they just want to Zoom. It's just, when it's it just, could just be a call, but no, it's a Zoom. It's like eight o'clock in the morning. I'm in bed. It's like it's never. It's not going anywhere either. Once all this is done <laughs> and everyone's got the vaccine, like DFR, mm. it's going to be here to stay. People aren't going to want to have meetings in the future. No, sure. It's just all Zoom. Zoom. Is it just me or have you exposed yourself on Zoom as well? <laughs> what, like with tit out? <sighs> oh, well, well, basically, you know what it is? In the house I'm living in right now, everyone's using Zoom. You yeah. know, I've got a, a 16-year-old that uh, is in sixth form on Zoom. But I only realised that the other day. So she said to me, oh, you know what, can I miss um, sociology? I was like, no, no, you have to go in, man. We was in school, mm. we didn't. You can't be lazy, just ride it out. So I woke up in the morning, I looked at the time, I said, 9 30, I could still hear her moving. She's trying to miss social, you know, after I've told her, you know, mm. just to go in. So, guy in the boxes, hey, hey, hey! <laughs> you gotta go sociology! <laughs> sociology. <laughs> The right thigh of my leg is dry as well. Ah, uh, you just cream the left one. I just cream the left one. I just yeah. boom, got in there. Quick things. She's got the laptop and the zooms there, and everyone starts laughing. Ah, oh, that's it then. You came out straight up boxes, dry leg. <sighs> and then today, assembly on Zoom. <laughs> what? No, I don't. Assembly on Zoom what today. Assembly on Zoom. Assembly. How does that work? Listen, all I saw the the screens got smaller. <laughs> Which means there's more people in than a hundred people in the Zoom. Do year sixes still sit on the benches? I don't know what assembly. People are lying on their beds like this in assembly. No, that's crazy. Do you remember assembly? You know what I used to do assembly? I sit up and just look around. I just, just look at, oh yeah, he's got earwax. Look over here. Oh, his bag's massive. I just look around. Let me to hear what you know, the, the, the head of year was saying. Yeah. But now we've got assemblies on Zoom. That's embarrassing, man. I don't even know what assembly was about, if I'm honest. I just used to sit there. I didn't take anything in. I'm hearing that they're doing <laughs> detention on Zoom, though, as well. I saw what? someone tweet saying about that. <laughs> that somebody was just got detention and they were just sitting there. I can't remember it word for word, but I, I think saw that. Sister on Twitter, saying, yeah. Yeah. Sister I saying, had detention no, on let Zoom, me take bro. Gloves off for this. Detention. There's no way I'm out. So detention means I hold you back because you can't go home. Now I'm at home, you're still holding, holding me back. back. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> How can we cancel Zoom, T? I know, see, you're the plug. How do we cancel Zoom? <laughs> it's here to stay, bro. I'm telling you. I've no. got a Zoom at 3.30 today. It's, it's life now. I mean, people are getting caught 
doing things as well on Zoom, as, as we've yeah. seen. Yeah. You know? People losing jobs for it as well. Like what? There was a, like a famous lawyer who writes for the New York Times. <laughs> he was on a Zoom call, thought it was over, and then just reached across for the, the wipes and the creams and the started... What, to start wanking? <laughs> Yeah, but he lost his job. He lost his but job. Just, so wait, he had a meeting and then he thought, you know what, meeting's over. Let me just bust a wank. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But, but the thing, problem was, was people the weren't on it. Mm. Yeah. But because it was one of those zooms where they record it, someone oh, went and watched it after and was like, "Oh shit!" My man's doing a little. Bit he of didn't one. close. He's the only one who didn't close it, and he's shoulder shaking on Zoom. Just that's, the thing about, video. that's the thing about the iMac with your two fingers. If you did a slide, yeah, the screen, you can you can change the zoom into a next kind of Zoom for yourself. <laughs> you know what I mean? Tube AX videos, yeah, that's yeah. right in front of you now. Red tube. But the camera don't move. The screen yeah. moves, but the camera's still there. This is true. That's why I think, like, the other day, when I went on Sky Sports and I um, was on Zoom, obviously, in the evening, I decided that I'm going to make this sort of shake, innit? So, I was thinking, oh, even though I've logged out, I need to restart the computer. Then I went and got a jumper, covered the camera. Oh, I you, was, like, you could have got like some blue tack or something. Oh, blue, I, ain't, yeah, well, yeah. I ain't got that in my house. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't stick posters in it up. I ain't got a dinner hour, I don't know them on the wall anymore. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So um, I covered the, the camera and I was shoulder shaking, but it was like, it was dead because like, now my whole like, screen has got this black shadow. Yeah. So it's not the same. So you've seen half of the porn? I've seen half of the porn. Okay, yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's, that's why what, for me, it's just like... What's like your go-to porn site? Have you got like a couple or is it just like one that you will go to? <laughs> oh, I like you, Snoochie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. My go-to. Yeah. My go-to is a group with me, Poet and all the man. And I say, boys. What? Yeah, what? I ask you guys. I, oh, is yeah. that on a Zoom call as well? You're both watching share screen? No, that's, that's on the phone. The phone's on the right, side. Okay, yeah, so yeah. I'll go on there. Like, boys. the share screen thing. Nah, no, oh, that's, that's all too. That's, that's, <laughs> I can't handle that. Yeah. But I would just ask the boys, boys, where shall I go? And someone would send me to the right place. Schizolumos, yeah. Schizolumos always. Go. I've got some serious files. I don't know if you saw Margs' timeline yesterday. The retweet he put up. I don't know. Oh, yes, yes, yes. About him. Um, was it eating bum? <laughs> no, no. Just if you want, if you want porn, <laughs> go to Marx's timeline. Oh, he's just retweeting just it. Just go to Marx's timeline. Are you, you, do, do you watch a lot of porn? Obviously, it's lockdown. You know, we're at home. The screen's there. Yeah, yeah. Um, no, do you know what? I've actually stopped watching porn. I don't watch porn anymore. Uh, now, okay. This is what. That's what. Yeah. This don't, is my relapse. This, don't relapse. <laughs> <laughs> don't relapse. Don't relapse, man. So what? You've you've quit. Yeah. Why? I used to. Why? Obviously, Tell me I think why. Everyone has watched porn before. I used to, but no, nah, I just nah. Was it really? I think so, yeah, and I think it gives you a false like kind of uh, idea of what sex is kind of like, if it make, if that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah of course it, it does. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah. I was like, do you know what? Not that I was on it every every night after a Zoom meeting. Yo, do you know what I mean? But, after like, a Zoom <laughs> do you know what I mean? Yeah. On extra, excuse me, I'm wanking that. No, it wasn't that, but like, yeah, I just I just stopped it. I haven't watched it in time, to be fair. See, that's what I'm trying to be. I'm trying to be kind of like because I, I did the don't uh, like I, I, I told Tigo I said look, I need to stop because yeah. it's affecting me. Like, I'm not even interested in looking at women anymore because everything's virtual in my brain. Yeah. But... Maybe a sex doll. Huh? Ooh. That, that, that is going to happen in the next 20 years, I reckon. It's already happening. To you, or...? <laughs> no, I mean, to the, to the population. Speak, yeah, speak, happening. yeah, speak. They talk now. There was one on, like, this morning or something. He came yeah. on there, I think he's, like, in a relationship with a sex doll. No, this Kazakh guy, yeah, he's married to it. Yeah, yeah. that's it. Married to the sex doll. <laughs> mm. She, like, speaks and she gets warm. <laughs> The sex doll was on Good Morning with Pierce Morgan and my, my, no, my beautiful... No, I think it was the other one this morning. Yeah, this, this morning. morning um, which is Holly and, Holly and Phil. The man and like Phil. Yeah, yeah. yeah and the, uh, do the doll gets warm as well. Don't you think that's scary now? Yeah. Yeah, of course it's scary. It's like banging a table, isn't it? Really and truly, isn't it? <laughs> or a car exhaust pipe. <laughs> yeah, because it's, it's, yeah. we're taking it to, to, the, to them levels. Yeah. Yes. They say it's an inevitable conclusion. Especially, again, COVID probably has accelerated the number of sex dolls being bought. Yeah. Because people can't just link up and... Go to the bar and... But it's still not the same. Because obviously, if I'm giving the sex doll the drill, it's not really going, ah! No, it can make it noises. It's can, a robot. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Like yeah. You can... Oh, so... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, so there must be a button in yeah, the, yeah, in the, when you press it. Yeah, ah! you turn it on. You turn it on, that's why it gets warm as well. Yeah. Like, this is what I was looking at when it was on this morning. Not that I've like researched, but yeah. yeah. It, it gets like warm. Speak. Yeah, you know a lot about it's sex It's got under soul. You know a lot. Huh? You've got one, Snoochie! <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't! 
This is this is why she doesn't need porn. No, it gets this warm. is why she doesn't need you know porn. I mean? I've got my sex down in the yards <laughs> in the dressing room. Get it out on a Friday night. Good to go. But um, nah. Yeah, we shouldn't cool. we shouldn't kink shame people though. Yeah, no, yeah. each their own man. What does that mean? What is, you got, that's a big word you used there. People nah, have got their kinks, kink, innit? Kink yeah. shame. Yeah. Shaming people that have kinks. No, you can have it. People have, it. I have the objects if you want to have it. I'm just saying you might as well use a car table. And no, I'm lot. saying oh. like just yeah, like your your kink is situations. Yeah, okay, okay. We so can't so shame you, you mean for situations? that. Situations, what situationships yeah, or no situation like I like um like Pamela Anderson, you know like. Blondie blue eyes and all that kind of stuff. Oh, okay. From old school, so. Mm. Tigo, so I'm, I'm old school. school. <laughs> I'm old school. I was, I, I was here before Princess Diana, PBD. I mean, Jesus you know what I mean? But, now the kinks are real though. Like, um, I get a lot of messages and DMs about feet. I've seen All right, so I've I've seen seen I saw, I saw, yeah. I saw your DM today. Oh, yeah, that one. Was it a tweet? Was it a tweet? Was no, it was a DM. DM. It was nine o'clock in the morning. 9 a.m. Yeah. Before Can assembly. Before assembly. Before assembly. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Before assembly on the Zoom. Where is it? I put it on my story, but... Can I wear your ass like a face mask? I'm not sure how that would work, though. I'm thinking about it, and I'm just thinking about my ass, and I'm mm. thinking... Oh, are they talking about eating my ass? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just, I don't think you can walk around. Yeah. No, I was actually thinking that I was going to wear my ass. Yeah, yeah. eat my ass. Did you, how does that make you feel when you know that you've just got people just shoulder shaking behind closed doors? <laughs> I'm pretending that they're with you in the room and all that stuff. Do you? I'm not bothered at all. I think it's quite funny. Like someone messaged me today as well after that saying, I want you to be, um, I want to be your personal slave. Do you know what the mad thing is? I bet for a lot of these guys, it's a numbers game. They go to pretty girls on Instagram and they DM a lot of them. And the chances are one or two pay off. Okay. Because it's not just men who want this stuff that we might consider weird. There's women out yeah. there that yeah, want it. It's true. No, but all, all my friends, all my mandem friends, always message me about Sunuchi. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Dazza, <laughs> no. Rana, Issues, one. Frost, Kenny Styles, <laughs> JR, Richie, Miles even. <laughs> Slow down. You must came here for you. <laughs> the Magnum just went down. <laughs> Well, Snoochie was with Miles yesterday, but yeah, Miles, he didn't have a haircut, so his confidence yeah, confidence. Was low. That's, yeah. that's Miles' thing there. I'm not, if, I, if I ain't got a trim, I'm not talking to you. Exactly. <laughs> Ooh, gee. No, I'm looking good though, man. Looking cool. You've got, you got fans, yeah, you got fans, man. Yeah. You know that you've got fans. Nah. It's good though, man. So that, make, that means, I want to ask you this. Now you know you've got people shoulder shaking over you. Are you a shoulder shaker yourself? <laughs> <laughs> Mom, I'm sorry. Uh, Auntie, sorry, man. This is no rules. Are you asking it's me not me. over specific people? Nah, just in nah. general. No, obviously, I told you I used to watch mm. porn. So, but that, do you, so you do it? No, I used to watch how? porn, innit? Because I, I want to know how you do it. Oh, nah, <laughs> what do you mean? How do I do it? Like, step how? by step Yeah, do you use a vibrate? Do you use a vibrate? Do you use a. Yeah, you like, so, everyone's, everyone's different, you know? Yeah, it's true, man. Just a normal way, man. Standard well, just, way. Do you know, let me start eating my cheeseburger sandwich because um, cheeseburger sandwich is the best sandwich ever. What's the normal way after you told me people have got dolls and stuff? If we go on xvideos.com now, we can have a look. Do you know what I mean? So we'll be able to type it in, masturbation, shoulder shaking, and we'll see the go to way of flicking the beat. Have you ever tried to do it in a situation where it's, it's tricky? Like, have you risked it for a cracker? <laughs> what? <laughs> I like the way I asked that one. That was good. <laughs> was good yeah. So basically, like, for, like me, I've basically done it when all my aunties have been in the house. Nah. <laughs> and everyone's just moving around the house. Do, 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 but I'm still trying to get one quick one off. I mean, I've got a small family. It's my mum mm. and my brother. So, I mean, yeah, no. You've been caught? <laughs> no. No. Well, I don't all, think so. <laughs> always check your mirrors. That'd be awkward. She can let me know if she has, but I don't think so. She would have told me. She'd have mm. been like, what the hell are you doing? My mum's quite a loudmouth. That's good, man. Wank it in front of your... <laughs> 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 no, but it's... <laughs> it's funny, you say, no, you're yeah, saying, no, no. I just say I was in the back no. room, do you know what? <laughs> Busting a wank. <laughs> like no, but remember, like I didn't say I did it in front of them. I said, they might be in the house, but I'm in my room. But it just means that they can come in the, in the room. The door's closed, but they can come in at any time. But That's I'm so risking saying, it for like, a cracker. You're not scared, though. Huh? You're not, no, you're not scared, though. Like. Well, everyone takes risks, isn't it? I think that's part of it for you. Just risking, isn't it? Yeah. When we used to do, when we used to travel around the country, around the world, you would always, in the, ne the next morning, it would be like, last night, yeah, did you hear me? <laughs> no, <laughs> Thank, thankfully. So, how often is it then? Oh, for me? Yeah. It used to be a lot, like, I had a serious issue. 
<laughs> like I needed therapy. Jesus. Did you, oh yeah, you went therapy for it. Yeah, because just just doing it too much. Yeah, yeah. But then I started watching like videos of why you shouldn't do it, and that helped. What was that? But because it's a, it was just basically saying don't relapse. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Don't relapse. Go to wanking yeah. rehab. The thing is, and the thing is, honestly, when you finish doing what you're doing, you always feel so small. You feel like you've, you know, you've, you've taken five pounds from your mum's purse and she's caught you. Oh, why yeah. did I do that? Do you I know can what I mean? imagine that, especially if you're still doing the sock thing. Huh? The sock thing. I never said I'm doing the <laughs> sock thing. <laughs> <laughs> I never said I'm using it. No, 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 I'm just saying, isn't it? Like, All right, so, it'd be like that. Is there been any stories, I'm not saying of who, but someone had told you a story of a, of a sock? No, I think there's quite a common thing, though. Is it? In the group, I, I can tell you two oh. people off the top of my head right now. Doing it in a sock? Yeah. Oh, yeah, me. Like, that's, that's normal. You're telling like, me... Well, Vooj came on the show and oh, talked yeah, a lot Vooj. about it. Yeah, Vooj oh, is yeah, definitely... Vooj, a, yeah, Vooj yeah. Is the, and there's another one. You want chunks? From Sierra Leone. Harry Pinero. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. And he's so, sock... Sock guy, yeah. Oh. Wow. See, that's going too far. Yeah. <laughs> but there's no rules to it, is it? It's whatever you feel, isn't it? Whatever floats your boat, get on that boat and float. It was something we talk about with all of our guests, by the way. Yeah, yeah, what, it's wanking? No, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we call it shoulder shaking. It's the it's number shaking. one topic. And it's, it I'm takes good. us, ev- everyone's been everywhere. Someone's tried to do it underwater. Chunks, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Chunks. <laughs> they nearly died. How's that there's work? no oxygen. There's no oxygen under there. Yeah, that's crazy. That's, um, what, was he in a pool or was he in like... Pool, beach. Chunks in the pool. <laughs> like? He wasn't that rich. Was he he beach, rich like? now. <laughs> nah, I think he. I think he basically just poured what, under the bar? water into his little. He's got a little toilet in his house. He just kept pouring water just on the floor into, yeah, into yeah. the water. Where, like, started to rise, and then oh, he went yeah. on his knees. <laughs> the, that always his own little pool, man. Yeah. I mean, like if you're going to a if you're going to a bathroom. Putting you know water in a bucket and keep, you keep walking into the toilet back and forth, back and forth. You just go Surely, start wanking. You're gonna yeah, like, you're tired. Go what else? Now. Exactly. Sort it so, out. So yeah. Yeah. Chunks. Um, sorry, I had to tell Stitchy Shy. You don't tell no one. I told her. I actually, <laughs> <laughs> I actually met someone in a bar before. Mm. Um, obviously pre lockdown. Met a guy in a bar before, and I was getting a drink, and he came up to me. He had a light bulb fish. Uh-huh. And he started talk, talking to me about it because there was like some nice chandeliers where he was, mm. it was just around the bar somewhere in Shoreditch. And uh, he told me he had a light bulb fetish. And at uh, one time, I feel like I've said that, I feel like DFR knows the story, I don't know. But he likes to be, what's that word when you go up on, <laughs> where it's not, when you go on string, you bring yourself Acrob- up. Acrobatics? Harness. He harness. likes to be harnessed harness. up harness. to the lights. That's his, that's, Wrap is lights it? Lights round the partner as well and get it cracking. And the lights hot? I didn't sit there and ask really. I was just like, wow, that's insane. So he just, he just, he didn't even come and say, do you want a drink? He just said, I like that box. No, 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 he got me a drink after. He got me a drink after. We was yeah. just, we was just there at the bar. I'm going to just quickly look up light fetish. Yeah, look at light fetish. There's loads of different fetishes, you know. He I just approached like you and dropped this story like that. Mm-hmm. Ah, this world, I love it. I think there's going to, I feel like there will be a fetish for every single thing now. Like there's a fetish for shit. When one, mm, definitely is. Lamp, lamp <laughs> fetish. fetish for ghosts. This yeah. is a lamp fetish here. Okay. Uh, when one passes, looks at, or hears about a lamp or its shade, they feel, feel an overwhelming urge to perform highly sensual acts of indulgence. You got big words there. <laughs> Fucking hell. Slip. You got a fetish, Steve? Because you're wearing the worst sunglasses I've ever seen in the history of glasses made on this earth. I'm looking at you, I'm looking at my, I can see myself. Why? I bought these because Kenya Barris had them on Black, hmm? Black AF. Kenya Barris. I told you this before the cameras went. This is not an organic conversation. You know, you know you're wearing Big Boss Man's glasses. <laughs> and you're talking to me about Kenya. But this Big Boss Man's got nothing to do with the police in Kenya. Nothing to do with that. <laughs> but he might do. That's what police officers wear in them films, like, you know, Beverly yeah, Hills true. and stuff. Yeah, and they're always eating a donut. I've said this to you very times, but always yeah. eating a donut. That's what I'm going for. LAPD. I'm just fucking. I, honestly, I, I bought them and mm. I got them. They cost me 150 pound, and that's not, which is fine. But I got them. I was looking at them today, and I haven't had my beard trimmed in five weeks. I haven't really slept in two weeks. Um, so I was just like, I'm wearing sunglasses today. That's just the decision I made. There's no sun. There's no sun. But there's light. It's true. Yeah. 
So he's got a fetish. Tigo's got a fetish for life. I've got a fetish for exactly. life. I've got a life fetish. You was the guy that walked up to Snoochie's side and said, you got a fetish for life. But you was on your knees. Yeah, I know Tigo. I need to be. Yeah, I know Tigo, man. That's why it's so dark in here. That's it's light. I can't control myself. I think it's a year ago tomorrow was the last time we left the country. Which was to fly to Munich for 10 hours. Was I with you? Yeah. We don't like flying. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm not a flyer, man. I'm a Tigo. Left ten hours. Tigo's left me before on a plane to fly by myself, but we've yeah, spoken no, about no, it a few no, times. That's not what happens. But I, I'm, not, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I used to watch air crash investigations. <laughs> right. So that traumatized me, man. Yeah. Do you know what? I'm not really. A, I'm not really keen on the flying thing either. Mm. Like it's, it freaks me out. And the first flight I did mm. on my own was Hong Kong. That's a long. And that flight. was long. I was literally crying, and this person was looking at me like. You're annoying, fuck off. Mm. But I was just crying for the whole time. You can swear on this show as well. Yeah, I just said fuck off. Oh, just joking. She swears yeah. on her show. As well. <laughs> yeah. You've been on a cruise. Yeah, I've been on a cruise. But this is when I was like way younger. How old? I think I was like 15. Because I want to go, I want to go, I'm, 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 we're talking like cruise ship, like six floors, 6,000 people on this. Or yeah, talking? yeah, like a massive, I went on one of the big ones. What? It was called like Ocean Village or something, but my mum had like a show on the cruise ship that she was like choreographing. Um, but yeah, it went everywhere. What did your mum do? She, she's a choreographer. That was, yeah. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> teaching dancing and stuff? Yeah, basically. So she did like shows. Why don't they just say teaching dancing? Why do they have to say cho- chore and all the graphics? Well, choreography is not necessarily teaching dancing. It's, okay. It's working out routines and then making sure they all get the routines. What and he said. The yeah, your mum's got yeah. a better job than mine, man. <sighs> she used to be a cleaner. Well, my mum's on furlough now, so. Oh. Uh, my mum. <laughs> no, let's just. She passed away, so. Oh, okay, oh, yeah. so, so did my nan. That's good, it's life, man, you know what I mean? Any. Oh. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck off. Yeah, no, no, Do you believe me when I tell you this? Yes. Oh, okay, cool. Just, <laughs> no one takes me seriously, Stitch. I don't know why. Nah. But, um. Yeah, I want to go on a cruise. I was watching. This is the thing is that, you see, just because of lockdown, I'm running out of documentaries. So you want to go on a cruise because you're running out of documentaries? Of course. Or you watch, I watch, I watch, or you watch I watch, this documentary about cruises? Harmony, it was called. <laughs> okay. Uh-huh. Okay, Harmony. Where's this? Netflix, Amazon Prime? YouTube. BBC, YouTube. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you this Netflix stop paying monthly. I don't pay monthly for things, do you, man? We got Netflix. My money's, my money's you know what? Yours, I did you know? see you say that you haven't paid for your phone bill, man. No, Have you I not paid it yet? No, it's, I, I paid That's it now. I paid it now. I've got a, a new situation in Dulwich. So I Fuck to, off! Oh. Fuck off! <laughs> <laughs> I had to pay it, but I was watching this thing called Harmony, and it's basically showing me all these big cruises, and basically, what I was watching, I couldn't believe that. Right, I thought it was like a country. What? The, what I was seeing, I saw people playing football. They finish. They go and shower. They go to a rave. I'm just, I'm thinking, like, what's this? And then I'm so oh, a cru- on the cruise. On the okay, cruise. I'm with you now. Mm. So that's why I'm like, okay, I want to go. You know, I want to go and jump on. And it hug. is lit. But to be fair, I got mm. seasick the first couple of days. What's that? Seasick. When you vomit, when you see sea? What's well, seasick again? I think it's just it's like, your equilibrium. When it's the waves. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. my daughter tried to tell me she cast it. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, I get car sick when thing. I read in yeah, the car. Yeah. Is yeah. it? You just vomit. Because there's too much peripheral movement and you're focusing on one point. The equilibrium yeah. goes off and you get sick. Oh, I've had a stinker. Right I've had a stinker. Yeah. My oldest daughter told me she, she's car sick. She started vomiting everywhere. In the, in the car. But I thought that because I picked her up from a party, I thought she was drinking. Because <laughs> <laughs> I never heard of car sick. I'm not, I wasn't born in this future. I don't know about car sick. She's like, you're on their magnet. I, so I, I, I lost it. Give me your phone. Took her phone for a week. Really? And now you lot just, conf- you yeah, just confirmed that car sick. You need to apologise. Huh? You gotta apologize, man. Well, even though it was like two years ago, we could yeah, just, man. <laughs> just, just we go back. push it to the side. We gotta go back. And then she should take your phone. Yeah. Yeah. She can actually know when when the when the bill comes. Yeah, take <laughs> it. <laughs> and then that finished. Harmony. Harmony finished, and the next documentary was. But why is it called Harmony? What? I, I, I the think it was the name of the. Harmony. I think it was the okay. name of the cruise ship. Oh, the cruise ship. Yeah. After that was um, I watched. A documentary about a hotel, a haunted hotel in Malaysia. You was going in. What was this like? Recommended after the cruise ship one. We went from Harmony to Haunted. It went. Was you it, just... it, it finished. Yeah. Five second countdown. <laughs> dun, 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 boom boom. Dun, 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 dun. Da! It started. I said, "Oh, this one's." Su-. But this one, I, I kicked out after the first fifteen minutes because. 
basically they showed this hotel in Malaysia. It was meant to be haunted. UFOs and that land on it, apparently. <laughs> No, they land serious. on the hotel? Yeah, but someone in the comments Jesus will let us know, Christ. yeah? <laughs> well, why didn't like, there was one part where they said, basically, in this hotel, there was the fourth floor, they had like, four doors that were blocked off. No one can go in the doors because they were haunted. So the Chinese come and they put like a sign on the door to say the ghosts are here. From what I remember They're as a in kid. in this room. Casper. 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 The could, friendly ghost. Casper could... Go through the walls. Go through the walls. So you lock in the doors. What stops the ghosts from literally just going the next door. door? Yeah, this is true, man. So that's what I didn't like. So that's why I was like, ah, oh, this is some. Maybe these documentaries are full of shit. Full of shit, man. So you have to acknowledge the premise, accept the premise of Casper the Friendly Ghost being the archetype of the ghost, and then acknowledge that yes, they can fly through walls. Otherwise, it can't be real. But I do feel like ghosts should fly through walls. They have to. They're spirits. I get what you're saying. Steam like, what, goes through It doesn't make sense for Steam me for a spirit to literally walls. be like, right, I'm going to open, I have to open the door now, open the door, go into the next room, lock themselves in. Like, yeah. I feel like... I know, you're right. of course you're door. right. There's no question. But, but what if I said to you, right, the, the, play, the room where a, spirit, a person dies, that's the only room it can haunt. It can't go through walls. It's trapped in that room because it's like in I purgatory. I that as well. Yeah. Because, yeah. We don't know the rules to ghosts is my point, basically. You Ghost can't rules. say, I know I was watching this documentary, it doesn't abide by my rules for ghosts. No, but my point is this. There's more documentaries coming out <laughs> on YouTube whilst we're all stuck at home. <laughs> yes. About the ghosts. Go, everything. You go now, go, just type in, just type in, doc, you know, when you get into that, type in documentary on YouTube. Mm. <laughs> See what will come up. I'm hoping. See like, what that comes up. Now? I'm hoping it starts. See with, what like, comes up. Credible documentary. See what comes up. I need to Vice. see something lit specs, man. Because if I type in documentary, oh no, 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 don't, don't watch. I, I, I've got some stuff to show you. I mean, when you see kangaroos don't exist, that's <laughs> Wait, real. <what>? Documentary. <laughs> oh my god, the first documentary, the ghost of yeah, ghost we've got here, millionaire life, the woman with fifteen personalities, might be me. Uh, well, scariest hotel. <laughs> Is it there? <laughs> no, no, no. This is, oh, my God. Malaysia. World's scariest hotel, abandoned village, and UFO houses. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my I God. don't talk rubbish on this show. There, it's there. There's always 17% truth in this show. It's there, it's there. Not 77, 17. And then put a paper to balance it out. Huh? Put a paper to balance it out. Put a paper on the, He's got a documentary there as well. <laughs> yeah. He has, yeah. No, with the UFOs though. No. Just, he's got his documentary. It's just come up underneath the UFO house. You believe in UFOs even though the UFOs here? <laughs> do you believe in UFOs? <laughs> What's it got to do with UFOs? <laughs> do you believe in no, UFOs? I believe in them, man. I believe in them. My mum told me a story before that she played a Ouija ball back in the day. I'll never do that. I don't know what huh? she was on. She played a Ouija ball when she was younger, innit? She's using she she big words. What does that mean? <laughs> you know what a no, Ouija you know board what? is. You're just watching documentaries on haunted houses in you know, Malaysia. You, you, you put know what a Ouija hands board on is. it. Everyone puts their hands on it and they say it's like a little seance thing. Yeah, and then the, 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 the thing moves Moves. to letters and it spells the, the out words. Is it doing that? Let me see. Well, well I we don't have a Ouija board. I'm not going to. Yeah, but it will move to like. What about Mary? Mary in the mirror. Mary, Mary, Mary. Bloody Mary. Remember Candyman? Candyman, huh? Candyman, yeah. Candyman, Candyman. You said Candyman in the mirror? Yeah. No, I, do you know what? I never did that in nah, private class. Scary, too shook, man. man. Yeah. Too oh, shook. one more. Bear Witch. Yeah. Jeepers Creepers. Jeepers Creepers. But do you know what I like about all these stories back in the day? Why are you, why are you sitting like that? Why are you on your <laughs> knees behind your chair? Are you not on the chair? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even look. Because <laughs> he's wearing his Steve Jobs jumper. Do you know what I was thinking? All these haunted stories back in the day as a kid, yeah? We're only scary at night time. Have you told me these Jeeper Creepers <laughs> or a uh, 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 Blair Witch Project in daylight? No effect. Deep do, is that, do you want a question mark at the end of that or do you want to just know. make a statement? Haunted house during the day. <laughs> yeah. I'll go in there. <laughs> you would go in a haunted house during, during the, the day. day? Of course. <laughs> On your ones? Uh... I don't know about my ones. Specs won't go into the shop on his ones. Yeah, I know about my ones. You got them Dr. Martins though, so you'll be able to boot anything. You're fine. Uh, but, you've, got a, that, you've got that. A ghost. Protection. You know I mean? go, yeah, you're, but, booting but, you're booting the spirits. Go in there and I'll see you flipping George <laughs> Best just come out of a room. Nah. Someone said, oh, someone's, someone said that. When you, oh, please, just, just, watch the 20, just watch the first 20 minutes. Watch the first half of, the of that ghost. documentary, The Ghost One. Okay. Someone okay. said that basically every day at 1 a.m., you hear kids playing on the landing. There's no kids in the building. So it's like spirits. 
That is like... That's a little bit weird for me, man. Every person that makes up a ghost story uses that. You hear a car going past the door at 1am. <laughs> Why not 1pm? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Because because yeah. the mind is is how our brains work. Dark is scary. That's mm. natural. That's like it built into us from being cavemen. And like the mm. dark is where you can't see, mm. so it is more scary inherently. It's this is basic science, specs. I don't say it's basic science. Like as I should agree with it. Yeah, it's I'm here to crack. Facts. I'm here to crack codes. <laughs> to see, I'm going to crack a lot of codes. You know what I mean? I'm going to crack a lot of codes. I've already cracked the Australian code. I've got a T. I'm getting DMs again. Because obviously, Snoochie, I've told people that I don't believe Australia exists and I don't believe kangaroos. Do doesn't exist. Kangaroos are real. I don't believe those kind of animals are real. They are real, though. Have you, have you met one? Have you seen have one? You see, oh, have you seen the video of the kangaroo? It's like literally standing on its towel. The towel's like erect and it's just stood on the towel. I didn't even know they did that. Crazy. And you yeah. want me to believe that? This is all evidence so, for him. This yeah, so, so why do you. Right, so you've seen a kangaroo stand on its towel? Well, so, not in real life, but I saw it online. No, online? Yeah, yeah. And the legs are in the air. Yeah, so the legs... <laughs> no, they're not like up there. Yeah. But, but like, they're, they're levitating. So it's, so it's floating? Yeah. With the, the pouch? The pouch. Yeah? yeah, yeah, the pouch. Probably got the baby in the pouch. I don't know. So don't why know. are you not asking yourself... This might not be real. Why are you not asking yourself that? Um, probably because my family live in Australia. Oh, we got a problem now. We got a problem, <laughs> <Sorry. laughs> <We're laughs> problem <laughs> Stitchy. Yeah. You got family in Australia? Yeah. What part? I don't know. I've never been. I'm going to be real, I don't know. I'm going to say Sydney. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I'm sorry, oh. What's the zigzag in the boat called the zigzag in the... They, they show us as, The big white zigzag in Australia. What? Yeah, man. What, the, the graph? The big build, the, the building. Oh, the Sydney Opera House. Sydney Opera House, oh, right. that's it. The big zigzag the they show us. <laughs> it's a zigzag, it's a zigzag. It's the, 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 the top of the building. If you type in... Right, Again, okay. not Jeeves, Google me, yeah? <laughs> you type in, you, no, that you type in, Australia don't exist. Oh, here we go. And just write Chile. Chile? <laughs> C-H-I-L-E. Have you never watched Specs on Gasworks? Yeah, I have. Yeah, that's this, this where he first extolled his uh, theorem. Uh, Australia doesn't exist and other bizarre geographic conspiracy, conspiracy theories, okay. You get on with my mum. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. What's that, Sonji? She... <laughs> Capricorn. January. Yeah. Okay. Are you April? You're Leo, no? Huh? Taurus. Oh, I don't know. The ball. Taurus. The ball. I don't think I know who Taurus is. Oh, there's facts from everything I say, man. But you know what, Stitch, you got. It's not a fact, though, is it? It exists. Huh? What well, my family are there? Like, where are they living? Just like. They could be in Chile, though. Okay. That's the theory is that uh, people take off wherever they're flying from, mm. yeah. fly around in circles, then land in a bit of Chile that they took right. off the Chileans. <laughs> And they made it into Australia. And people think in Australia think they're in Australia. Even the Australians think they're in Australia. Do you believe okay. that? No. Okay. Oh, it's absolutely I'll nonsense. have to research into that a little bit more. It, listen, Australians, if I'm wrong... <laughs> <laughs> Australians, if I'm wrong, I am sorry. But if I'm right, oh, you're in big trouble. Because I saw kangaroo barbecue what? under one of my searches. <laughs> what does that mean? What, it means you can eat them <laughs> in restaurants. Yeah, kangaroo meat suffering, yeah. You want, me to eat, you want me to eat something that stands on its tail? <laughs> well, I guess you can eat its fucking towel. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Four pound fifty with chips. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that was a long Thank intro. You. Believe it or not, that was Is just that an intro. intro. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Let's get into yes. some serious Sundays. <laughs> serious Sundays are the comments from last week's episode. Last week we had darkest. A lot of people thought he was very reserved. Maybe he wasn't as explosive and crazy as we wanted him to be. But he's a normal human being with layers and like complexities. Yeah, yeah man. We're, we're all humans, isn't it? You know, like sometimes people just expect us just to jump off that bridge. Mm. And sometimes we just want to just take the stairs down. <laughs> exactly. That's what yeah, it is. There's man. no rules. Sometimes you want to slide. I'm like that, yeah. though. I'm a little bit shy in, not in real life, but, well, yeah. So you, you can never be. When, when, you see that shy? I want to take out for your name. You're not shy at all. Do you want to what? I want to take off your name. You're not shy. No, it's actually my name, Cheyenne. Oh, <laughs> not because you're shy. No, no, huh? Well, to be fair, my name was Charlotte. Yeah. 
And then first day of year seven, yeah. my mum was like, Cheyenne, Cheyenne, as I was asleep. And I was like, what the fuck, who's Cheyenne? I come downstairs, <laughs> Tia Farno's sister, I come downstairs, she's like, uh-huh. it's your name now, bitch. Like, and she made me go to school as Cheyenne. She's like, I never you know liked what? the name There's Charlotte. There's a conspiracy theory attached to this. There's a conspiracy theory attached to this. I can't believe it. I think, I think that's a sweat with your mum. I feel like you might have at Dalston Roof Park. I'm not, I'm, I'm sure I've met your mum. I, I need to, I need, I need, I need, I need, I need, I need, we nearly went that time. Do you remember in the old office? We came out, looked up, we yeah. saw it, and it's like we should go there. And then we kind of walked towards there, and then that woman was getting harassed by a crackhead, so we had to go and help. Oh, that, that woman. was near the side by a wing stop. That yeah, was the time. Yeah, yeah. Did was you with your mum that time at Finsley Park? You know, you wasn't. You wasn't. <laughs> was, 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 was your friend, didn't it? That was your friend. Sorry, that was your friend. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, what the rave park? That was the last time I saw. That was the last time I saw Snoochie, innit? Anyway, first comment. <laughs> we could do this all day. Mm. Yon H says, I nearly done it to a bus, out, bus down challenge. I'm dead. Speck said that he nearly shoulder shakes to a bus down challenge last week. Which one? Basically, yeah. I was on Twitter looking for a football argument. <laughs> and one girl... Looking for one. <laughs> one girl, basically, uh, she dropped down on the floor... Like, yeah. Pretend like she fell over, but got up and the Moseke <laughs> oh. came up with a wudum wudum wudum. Her and the Moseke headbutted each other. She put it this way, there, there, there. My hand was in my pocket straight away. I said, I "Go, let's go." Huh? Like, we're ready. We're ready to go. We're mate. ready to go. Yeah. But then it just finished, and I was just like, "Ah." Oh. So, so that that bust down challenge was actually kind of like was making me feel a little bit. It was distracting me from the relapse thing. Now that was a good week on the internet, you know. <laughs> Have you got one? That was good. No, I wanted to do one, but. Yeah. I was going through it, man. Is it? Yeah. Can I, wait, can I just say this? I, I just want to just because <laughs> bust down challenge. So girls are doing their makeup and getting ready. Is it bust down or bust it? Bust it. It's bust in it. Bust, bust it. it. Yeah, it yeah, says bu- bust down here. Yeah. Uh, right. We'll, we'll call it bust down because what's his name? Yon. Yon H. <laughs> oh God, let's go back to bust it. <laughs> <laughs> so makeup, get ready, do that challenge for ten seconds, and then we're done. And that's okay. She's okay. Well, yeah, you was fucking shoulder shaking over it, so I think so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so that's what you girls are doing. You lot are just doing that. We're not us do that. Be, no. I don't think anyone thought, do you know, we're going to do a 10 second video. We're going to be busting it down for five seconds. And someone's going to wank over it. Let's I don't see think if we can was, get you know Spex's I mean? hands in his pocket. <laughs> you know I mean? No, but do you know what? Some girls have got just, you know what I mean? They've just got it. You just, nah. You're watching it thinking, whoa, what's Some going on? Some of them here? challenges. Have you lie. seen the South African ones? Mm-mm. <sighs> Obviously, they've all got level ones. <laughs> So, the good thing about the camera, it goes down. So we don't see the top half. <laughs> Woo! The most second is different. Different. Sorry, sorry issues. <laughs> sorry, I got a picture from there. You are in love with South African women having level ones. Yeah, that's, that's, I've, as I'm African, I, I can say it. I've seen it. I was nearly there. Johannesburg. Coming soon. The next comment comes from Stylo. I don't think it's Stylo G. He says, Specs, I love the history of the potato. Also, Specs proceeds to ask where potatoes come from. I love potatoes. <laughs> oh, I think potatoes are amazing. I don't one know why you... Be- one of the best things ever created. Well, well, Stoochie's on it as well. What would you have it with? Cheese and beans. <laughs> huh? Straight to the point, cheese and beans. Sometimes I'll just have it straight with butter. What beans are we talking? Baked beans. <laughs> <laughs> no, please, no, 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 please. You know what? Why was she supposed please, to have a jacket potato with? Please let me go and hug her, man. What, like kidney beans? Let me, let me go and hug her. Do you know, there's bad different kind of beans. And I don't care what anyone says, yeah. no, I don't season my baked beans. No. I don't see the point. Do I, hate, my, I hate when people do that. Do I, I don't see this? the point. We're taking it too far. I'm sorry. It's like got so much sugar and flavour in it. Why are you adding just bare nah, stuff I to it? I like seasoning my food, but the baked beans, beans they, yes, I feel 100%. like they're fine on their ones. People just being extra. Seeing onions being put in the beans. Nope. That's getting too far from me. Yeah. Can, can I show um, Snoochie my, um, my meal I had today? One of my favourite meals? Yeah, I'll, I'll just put it up <laughs> here. A little bit scared now. You need to see the way I eat, man, Snoochie. It's amazing. I hope it's good because I kind of like oven food. See, I would eat that. I'm not sure about the ketchup. Like, I'd, yeah. Ketchup on beans is wrong, yeah. I don't like ketchup on food like that. But... Um, is that mashed potatoes? <laughs> <laughs> I agree, I agree. What I had that? to zoom in quite close, actually. Oh, I okay, still that's ma- is that mash? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, mash. yeah. Mash. mash beans and are they vegan sausages? Yeah, yeah. Veggie yeah. sausages, yeah. 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 Linda McCartney. Well. That that's specs right. every day. 
every day in the morning. Every day. Do you know what I do every day? My morning ritual, obviously a little bit of meditation, yoga, but for breakfast, yeah, three eggs, two boiled eggs in a Marmite sandwich. Amazing. That sounds class. <laughs> that sounds class. <laughs> Honestly, it's so amazing, mm. bro. <laughs> that sounds class. I Marmite just, is so versatile. It really is. Like, yeah. The slogan that they've got, love it or hate it, is the truth. Yeah. I've Ab- even got a Marmite ring, bro. Yeah, Marmite is amazing. Marmite, Marmite and, and eggs. I've never had Marmite and eggs. That's, that, that sounds class. Try it tomorrow. Yeah, yeah 100%. Because I really feel like Pret is missing out. You said egg. <laughs> <laughs> egg. That's chicken before the chicken's even grown. It's tr- yeah, but it's not really a chicken, though, is it? It's just, I don't You're know. meant to be... I you- feel like it's just past. No, I'm not vegan. <laughs> I was, but I'm not vegan anymore. You know when you found out about, you know, egg for a documentary last week? <laughs> oh, here we go. What is it like that? I didn't know. I didn't know. Honestly, all these I love. I loved scrambled egg. You didn't know the egg. Not not the egg with the big yellow in the middle, (laughs) looking like the sun (laughs) in the sky. (laughs) Don't like that kind of egg. Yeah, that's not really my favorite egg either. Mixed. Scrambled thing. Yeah, scrambled. Boiled. But then I found out that you know that is the egg. That's a chicken before. So basically, it's like, is it like the fetus? I would like to look at it as it's pus. Well, oh, actually, not past, but just... No, but I feel like that's better than... Yeah. Looking at it like it's a I stopped, baby I, chicken. It put me off. It put me off. What, you not had an egg? Oh, no, 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 I've had it. I've, I, I used to love it, but I'm not eating egg. 20, 2021, I'm not eating egg. Unless really? Boris says that we have to come out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not eating egg. I'm not eating egg. I was well, fuming. What's wrong with egg? Oh, it's amazing. Uh, but you're, what you're saying doesn't make sense. What let about it, let, milk? let the chicken grow. Milk? I know you don't really drink milk. Huh? Oh, no, come on, milk, milk in my body. But you're a big butter yeah, fan. Butter, yeah, I love butter. Where's yeah, butter come from? That's, Don't that's do milk. Huh? That's milk. Butter is milk. Yeah. Is it? Cheese and milk and butter are all the dairy, same thing. It? Yeah, well, it's not really doing nothing to my belly, but when I have milk on its own, oh, yo, yo, But yo. do you have, so what do you have, like oat milk? No, nah, for breakfast, so if I'm having porridge, I have hot water, or a wheat mix of hot water. Snoochie, come on, don't no, give me that. I remember um, him saying yes, exactly. it's the Ribena one. Didn't you say you had Ribena or something? I can't remember. <laughs> oh, the, oh, you the, can't put water in porridge. It don't work. Yeah, don't you work. Got a picture of that? Have I got a picture? I've got, have I got a bit? I don't have a picture, no. Can you actually mix porridge with water? Can you? Yeah. yeah, it's... Um, it even tastes nice. You don't believe me, do you? I Shall I make a phone call? Do you remember, do you remember in uh, Oliver... Call Twi- a friend. Do you remember in Oliver Twist, do you remember what the food they ate at the uh, orphanage was called? Porridge. It was called gruel, oh which God. is porridge with water. That's oh. basically what gruel is. But and it's he thin. asked for more. Yeah, exactly. He loves so, it. So, I just hot water mix and then brown sugar. You mix it. I do like brown it sugar. The taste is tastes like strawberries. I don't think I'm going to be on that flex. <laughs> I'm kind of on the oat milk thing, but yeah, okay. All right. Next comment mm. comes from Yasir Hussain, forty-two. Specs looks like Riyad Mahrez without glasses. Is it? That's interesting. Yeah, a little bit. Why? Because of my Arab looks. Yeah. Arab heritage. Yeah. <clears throat> so I've got Arab in my blood, basically. Yeah. That's crazy. Apparently. Monty Badmus says Specs looks like a dark Smurf. Okay, we've gone from Arab to Smurf. <laughs> I, don't like the, I don't like the sound of Smurf. What does that mean, Snoochie? Smurf is them blue things, no? What, what, on, on Tigo's head? <laughs> basically. I don't like that. It's the blue small things with like the white hats right, on. Well, I'm not really that? getting Smurf vibes from you. Yeah. I'll be real, I'm not getting a Smurf vibe. That's good. Like last week, you would have got Smurf vibes. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Last week, he was very Smurfy. Hold on, let's just quickly get a shot of last week's I'm seeing show. more sophistication from you. Is it? Yeah, yeah. like you're, you've got that sophistication just coming through, man. I like that. That's, that's a big word. That sounds, I like that, sophistication. Mm. You've heard that word before. You know that oh, word. Yeah, of, course, of course, of course. I, I, I did go to school. <laughs> I'm not like not your kind of school. Yeah, okay. Smurf-y. Yeah, you've got Smurf vibes going on. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You've you switched up the hat. Yeah. That's what it is. You switch up the hat. No, no, no. This is because I'm from Islington. It's kind of like very. Yeah. And he's wearing the um, Steve Jobs jumper. Steve Jobs. Yeah. Mm. Uh, last comment comes from Bolu. What? Adek Bonma. What? <laughs> What? Bolu, that, that must be the comment already. Bolu Ad, Adek Bonmeyer, or Bongmeyer, maybe. Bolu Adek Bonmeyer. Let's go with that. That better be allowed, that name. Yeah. Specs without his glasses equals size the same si- uh, eyes the same size as Critical's head. Specs without glasses, eyes the same size as Miles's head. <laughs> I get it. Trying to say that, I can't see. 
It's never good. I don't think that's what they were saying. They were saying Miles. <laughs> I mean, is yeah, Miles well, is saying Stucci doesn't, doesn't wear glasses, so we'll ask Stucci. Let's ask Stucci, yeah? Bolo <laughs> Akabokulu. Stucci, Miles, you got a small head? Yeah. It's critical, we got a big head. We were actually talking about it yesterday that Miles' head is quite small and his ears. Yeah, because he's got to tuck them into his hat. Yeah. All right, so I won't. Tiny, my, so my eyes won't lie to me about Miles' head. I had head. to find a hat yesterday to give him. Is it? Mm. What about critical? Yeah, he's been on the he's been on the show. Yeah, yeah. I'm he's right been on the right. show and he's agreed that he's broke something. Yeah. <laughs> His head is there, isn't it? It's there, isn't it? It's there, man. So they get I've my eyes in line. I've got quite a big head to be. No, you've no, I do. Don't. I do have got a big hey, head. I've got a big head. Snoochy, come on, man. Critical. We've just spoken about critical. You're going to see it. I as well. My head doesn't fit into one size hats. No, just mine. But critical can't get on a plane. <laughs> Can you get on a plane? Well, yeah. There you go. Convertible planes. <laughs> So noisy. <laughs> <laughs> I said I wasn't going to cuss critical this year, man. Did you? Yeah, I'll bowl it like a baboclu. Flipping hell. All right, you know what it's time for? It's time for Heady One and Snoochie to announce they're having a kid. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think that would be going on. <laughs> it's time for what is going to be a controversial segment because Snoochie Shy has been in trouble for this recently what? on Twitter. Remem- remember wrestling. I know I've spoke to you about wrestling. Me and Snoochie had a sick chat with Reebok probably two years ago now, T. Yeah, it was two years ago. And we spoke yeah, about wrestling. A while ago, yeah. Yeah, we spoke about wrestling. I remember her talking about The Undertaker. Yeah. The Undertaker. But. Who I but. <laughs> but. <laughs> okay. But. Seen, though, <laughs> okay. Snoochie does a really fun little quiz challenge on her radio show on One Extra. Yeah. With alcohol. With alcohol. Yeah. You're fucked. I'm forgetting who you were playing against. <laughs> Abracadabra. It was Abracadabra, Bigger yeah. Abra, man. Yeah. Mm. And it was, uh, how many wrestlers can you name in, I think it might have been a minute. No, it was five seconds. Uh, fi- no, well, f- well, five seconds. Yes. Okay. Five wrestlers okay. in five seconds. Okay. Whilst you've already had about like 10 shots. Yeah. It didn't go well. What are you drinking? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. no when, when you just airdrop that to me. We're not going to go past that. What is that? It's Magnum. My mum got me this for Christmas. Pick up to Mama Cage, you know what I'm saying? Let me see. Pink embezzled. It's got Snoochie Shine it with a So you poured Magnum it. into a perfume box? No, it's not a perfume box. Let me see. It's a fucking flask. But the, the, the spray. T- no, don't spray. You just oh. you go out and twist it. Yeah, I mean. Okay, that's different. Boy. It's like she's, that is, I've never seen an alcohol bottle like that in my life. <laughs> that's class, yeah. Uh, let's just listen to your answers. Oh, God. Snoochie. You... I'll be letting you down here. Oh. To name five wrestlers from the AEW promotion. That just means five wrestlers. Like, like The Rock, um, Uncle Kane, um, Big Show, Hulk Hogan, and also The Terminator! <laughs> 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 To be fair, <laughs> wait. I did mean the Undertaker, but the shots just took over, and I don't know why I called Kane Uncle. I don't know uncle where the Kane. Uncle came from, but it just came out. But you have to. He's, 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 a, he's the mayor of a state. <laughs> he's definitely an uncle. T was terminating wrestling. Yes, he was no, in the game. Robo-cop, no, Robocop. Terminator Robo-cop. was in the game. Robo-cop. What game? The wrestling game. Terminator. Google it. Terminator was in the wrestling game. <laughs> Look, oh my up. god, he was in WWE 2K16. So who, who said 2K16? <laughs> Look at the entrance. It's gonna come through, through the door. He's in there. Sorry. Oh my god, with the Terminator. <laughs> He's got a jacket on. <laughs> oh, this was just the best PlayStation game. So technically... You're right. Stitchy, what does your spirit tell you <laughs> about my relationship with Terminator? With Terminator? <laughs> yeah, right now. What does your spirit tell you? What, what are you thinking about that? Yeah. That you wish you was doing that entrance? Okay, so we're That's talking... It's one of my favourite films of all time. Terminator, the film. John Connor. I've never watched it. What? Don't be. What do you, what do you mean? You, you're mentioning Terminator from wrestling. Well, I know it, but I've never watched you it. You better watch it tonight. Forget well, the documentaries. Well, okay, watch them tonight. Fuck the UFOs. Terminator. <laughs> <laughs> do you know what I mean? 
<laughs> I'll, I'll give it a watch. So what, Greg? Arnold Schwarzenegger never made, never come out in wrestling. He did come out in wrestling, yeah. As he's, I think he's in the WWE Hall of Fame. All right, just check it because I was in my head. I'm thinking WWE Vince McMahon always draws for the the, the, the celebrities. Always calls them to come through, make a special en- en- uh, entrance. Always. Yeah, I'm sure he's been on. I'm sure he's been on. Wait. Look, yeah, yeah, look. There he is with yeah. Hulk Hogan. Class. That's yeah. so. No, that's it. But that's it. Yeah. Early two thousands. I would have loved to have been backstage presenter for the rest of them. Just yeah, like, yeah, you'd have been good at that. I just love who that. was your like your wrestling crush? Crush. Yeah, like who did you? I feel like for me it would have been Rey Mysterio just because it was mysterious and I like a little bit of mystery to a guy. So have you ever seen what he looks like under me. the mask? No. Okay. I've never seen that. What? Mm. I like a little bit of mystery. Yeah. Not toxic. Yeah. And not emotionally unavailable. <laughs> but a little bit of mystery. Can't drop all your cards too soon. Is that him? Yeah. Oh, wow. Kind of like kind a of, 90s face. boy band kind yeah, of look. Yeah, yeah, he's giving me, um, yeah, he's 17. Yeah. Do you remember any, any of the female wrestlers? No, not really. Not China? No, I do oh. no. When I was just, more of mm. a PlayStation guy. I yeah, used to play yeah. the game, do the story mode, all that shit. But, um, no, I don't remember the guys. If you played the game, man, for me, you're part of it. That's the truth. 100%, yeah. I'm basically a wrestler. Did you play it with your brother? What, wrestling? Yeah. What, like real life? Yeah. I mean, yeah, we fucking come blow to blow before. No, no. <laughs> what are you talking about? Not street for not hardcore match. <laughs> just, just a normal slam <laughs> and a pin. Not breaking cups on each other's head. We've done all of it. Do you know what I mean? Um, big him up. Yeah, no. I think I've still got the wrestling game at my house because I know everyone's on the PS5, but I've got the PlayStation 2 at mine. <laughs> Fuck it, I don't care. Sick. Some lit yeah, games are and you can play PlayStation 1 games, on the PS2, so I've got the original Tomb Raider. That's, I think that's the best you Tomb Raider. Tomb Raider's ever. better than Call of, of Duty to date. Of course it is. Games now are shit. Zelda's nice. better than FIFA yeah. to date. Yeah, yeah. Those games back in the day are class. Mario Kart, whatever. What? Yeah, Sonic. Yeah. Sonic the Hedgehog. A- Alex the Kid, he's a man now. <laughs> um, what other games are that? Oh, what, what, True what? Crime. True... No, come on. In the streets of oh. LA. You know... You know True Crime was a game? Yeah. It was a I thought that was an investigation channel where you watch... That's True Crime, no? But no, that is an investigation. It's another documentary, yeah. I, but it was, it was a game. game. Yeah. I didn't know. I didn't know was that. It, wasn't Black and white cover. Well. Is it? In Something the streets like. of LA. You know, it was a lit one. It was kind of like, like GTA vibes, but it was it. Remember the GameCube? Yeah. Oh, of course I remember GameCube. Yeah, black yeah. and white cover. Yeah, I remember True oh, Crime. True Crime. I nearly got a GameCube, man. It. Thanks to my uncle's lies. <laughs> what? And he said he would get me one for my birthday. No, GameCube was it, man. I used to go play uh, Sonic and go into Cheo's world. <laughs> and what, what, what's yours? What, what, what did you do that? there? <laughs> <laughs> what did you do in <laughs> Cheo's world? Cheo's world, man. It was like them little... Do you not remember? Like when you'd get... Um, I think you would go get boxes mm. and then a little Cheo would come out. It's like a little floaty thing with like a little thing on top of the head. They're kind of blue. You go to Cheo's world and you just like give birth to loads of them. People in the comments will know. <laughs> they will know this. I'm sure I don't it's know. called Cheo's world. And then the theme tune mm. when you'd get there was like... Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> what are, are you talking about? You were playing this yesterday. You were playing this yesterday. <laughs> just, we've gone from wrestling to gaming. This, uh, Game that's why I love this so much. Game, yeah. Game Boy Advance was lit as well, man. Game Boy Advance was good, but the screen was too uh, dark. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. When you turn the brightness up properly. And then there's Game Gear and Tamagotchi. <laughs> yeah, it's Tamagotchi. Never yeah. played that. You never had a Tamagotchi? No. Nope. Snitch, you never had a Tamagotchi. I you got a cat now. You never had a Tamagotchi before. <laughs> no, I never had a Tamagotchi. Oh, that's that thing that looks... It's, it looks like a brick, really, but it's... Yeah, yeah no, and you, you, you attach it to your keys. No, I never you had feed that. It I had Pokemon cards, but I didn't have that. Yeah. Tamagotchi, no. Nah. I've actually had a real-life cat, so my energy yeah. was on that. <laughs> real-life cats don't normally need that much energy. Yeah. You've got well, a unique Magnum cat. Plus. Yeah. He's <laughs> fucked, mate. So you don't, let him, you, you don't let him go out by himself? No. No, I live on a flat, so he goes on the balcony, mm. but I've tried to take him in the flat gardens, literally scratch the shit out of me. Are you allowed to do all this? What you're doing, are you allowed to do with a cat? Are you allowed to do that? I'm allowed to live with a cat. No, are you allowed to treat a cat like it's a dog? Because you know that like, cats can go back and someone come back, but you're saying He's no basically thing. like a dog anyway, because he's a main coon, he's half okay. main coon, and all they right. give off like dog tendency. So he plays fetch, like he has a bath, huh? he eats like Stucci, you throw the stick and the cat the goes and brings you the stick? Yeah, yeah. I'm sure I've got videos. You sure this is a cat? <laughs> bro, I don't, at this point, I'm thinking... Anyhow, you've got a little baby kangaroo so, in your house. I'm thinking, yeah. bro, my mum came over the other day, yeah, she's yeah. got a cat, obviously. And uh, she was like, I want my cat to have babies. 
And I was like, cool, I want another kitten anyway, because I want to name the kitten Malibu, Malibu mm. and Magnum. So she brought the cat over, Delicious. and uh, Magnum has still got his balls. I haven't had them chopped off yet. It's gone. So, cat was there. She was literally ready. Do you know what I mean? It's like having a chick in their underwear. She's like, yeah, I'm ready. Magnum was just like, no. Started hissing at her. Nothing Well, he doesn't, doesn't know what to do, does he? He actually tried to hump my mum's leg instead. So... <laughs> So I if think he's more. Smelled the water, <laughs> if you smelled the pheromones. <laughs> he's more into humans. We we'll have to get a cat on this show, man. <laughs> he's a funny it's cat. A I've seen him on Instagram. Is he's it a funny cat? Yeah, hundred yeah, yeah. percent. I think I've seen. I've, I just you might as well just get a dog as well, man. Oh, no, your cat. I wouldn't be able to do a dog. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't be able to do a dog. That would go too far. They're very needy. I want to get another dog. I want to get. I have a Yorkshire Terrier. Pablo is. Can you get rid of this one as well? Or? Huh? No, 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 no. Because you, I didn't know you can get dogs that don't give you allergy problems. How does that make sense? Hair, the one without hair? No, no, they, the Greg's one has got no allergy problems. Yeah. It's like a different kind of hair. They breed it weird. It's um, because according play, to, playing God, some would say. Because according to Charlotte, the, the, the dog I had oh, has human here, hair. No, not you, not Charlotte. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, <laughs> never Charlotte. That, I, mean, yeah. I thought you just dead named you. No, no, Charlotte is the... Um, Charlotte... Uh, oh, yeah, of course, downstairs. <laughs> she said no my <laughs> dog had human hair. Two, like what? two years later, yeah. What, she's allergic to the human hair? Yeah, my missus was allergic to uh, the, the hair. So what's Charlotte got to do with this? <laughs> she said that the... Um, what is going on? The dog that I had, had human hair, that's why. Yeah, but you've got human hair. That's what I'm saying. So why are you not allergic that's to That's what hair? I'm saying. <laughs> so she fooled me, that's why I got rid of her. I'm looking at you, missus, right now. Come and tell me about allergies. It was me that was the allergy. You blamed it on the dog. We had to go put the dog in Battersea Park. And if that dog sit in fancy bar three more days, they would have put the dog down. And I watched the video of dogs being put down, and it's not nice. The owner's crying throughout the whole thing. The dog has got the mouth open, smiling. <laughs> Putting your animal down is not the one. I'm telling you, it's not, it's not the one. I'm, I will never put my animal down. Never. You'll just... Leave it behind at Battersea Dogs Home and just forget <laughs> about it. Hope for the best. <laughs> just hope it's not take, Taking my animal to a vet, they give my, they give my animal wristbands. <laughs> like it's going to get champagne and everything for free. And the next minute it puts it to sleep and then it's, it puts it down. Oh, yeah, that's me. Nah, man. You, There's videos on YouTube again. <laughs> All go, these videos. Yeah, documentaries. Yeah. No, no. This, this Specs is... watched a compilation video of people taking their dogs to the vet and having it put down. Specs watched a whole video of that. And what was the reason behind that? Just because you was wondering what happened from Battersea Park or just stumbled across it again Especially like the UFO watching, house? I, I was watching football. <laughs> Again, football finished. Five, four, three, two, one. Next video. <laughs> Soldiers. What team are you asking? Homecoming in America. <laughs> okay, next video. Animals getting put down. I thought, animals getting put down. <laughs> to me, put down means animals in your hand. You put it on the floor <laughs> and go and play. Oh, yeah. I didn't know you were going to give it wristbands and put it in the And adults. how long was this program? Ooh, probably about an hour. Jesus, yeah. He's... I willed it. After the hour, I willed it. Like, thinking... <laughs> Do you know what happened? Mm. Snoochie, I promise you, my kids, I'm watching it, yeah? I'm like, 44 minutes in. Yeah. This I hear. Crying. Oh, dear. After 45 minutes, though, I thought it would have been after, like, five. No, because then I started realising that when the owners are crying, I'm expecting that scene to come back. But it kept moving on. Oh shit. So then I realised, oh, that dog's really gone. <laughs> and that's that made me, it made me yeah, that made me emotional. <laughs> T, why are you laughing when uh, I tell you my I emotional just, stories? I like. just, I've heard it before, but oh. also I've just remembered that we're doing Remember Wrestling. So maybe, oh, shit. maybe, maybe <laughs> this is the perfect opportunity to move on There's to... There's no rules, is there? No rules news. <laughs> and I say it's the perfect opportunity because uh, this story comes from uh, news18.com. Owner spends $300 to treat his dog's limping, later finds out he was imitating him out of sympathy. This is really the animal show this. today, Sidney. <laughs> it's really no, the I animal really show. I really should have brought Magnum. I know you wouldn't have liked anyone, but I just should have brought him. The dog... I saw this. The dog... The, the man's got a cast <laughs> on his leg, and he's walking with crutches, and his dog, which appears to be some kind of greyhound, is limping along with him, one leg just like not touching the ground. They went to the vet and they found out he was just showing sympathy to his owner. This is why animals are amazing suspects. They're amazing. And they're expensive. 
Oh, no, of course they're expert. 300 pound in the vet for an x-ray. I wanted the French, fine. what's it called? French what? The little small one? French, French bulldog. bulldog. I, want, I was like... They're cute. They're cute. What, three and a half grand? Do you know what? Having a dog is just like having a baby. I can't... I'm not ready for that, man. Not yet. Cat is, I think, is less pressure than the dog. Self-sufficient. Yeah, yeah 100%. Yeah. They do what they want. I, I ain't got to rush home just to walk the dog out because the dog might shit in the house. Yeah, Magnum's got his little box. He's fine. Mm. He'll shit on the stones. <laughs> Cover it up as well. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> I should have let I should have let him actually continue shitting in the toilet, but I stopped. I put a stop to it. Huh? Because at that point I only had one toilet, <laughs> and it was just very. This is the car flush. <laughs> you should have put my hand up. Yeah. What toilet are we talking about here? The toilet in my house. So what, you you hold him. Uh, had, 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 no, 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 no. So because this is like imitating. Right. So Magnum does imitate. Yeah. So this really is the zoo show, animal show. But um, when I first got here, like he was playing fetch and stuff, he would imitate me using the toilet. But he can't flush. So no, you don't no, really exactly. want a cat doing that if it can't flush. Because every time you go in there. But what also is weird as well and awkward is like you've got a lad round. He needs to go to the toilet. Knocking on the door, <laughs> cats on the toilet, doing <laughs> shit. He's trying to bust the shit, but the cat's there. So it's kind of like, yeah. So I trained him off of it, but I kind of wish that I didn't now. That's a very you know niche what? problem, that uh, one. I, I, I promise, watch, watch what I'm going to buy tomorrow morning. What cat? Or toilet? Let me see. Let me see. Watch, <laughs> watch what I buy. You think it's a joke? A litter box. I'm buying a cat tomorrow. Oh, you okay. tell me I can be football manager, lose, and the cat's going to pretend to lose as well. <laughs> of course. <I'm, laughs> I am buying a cat tomorrow. All right, this next story, uh, Specs, this one's really, you really need to help snooze you through this story. It's from The Independent. Police mistaken for strippers after they raid Argentine swingers party. Snoochie, I've been to go- going swinger parties. I've been going to six parties. Is it? Seriously. How are they? Um, a bit strange, obviously, because I, I go there not to get involved. I go there to save all the information I'm seeing <laughs> to come and talk about on this show. Okay. That's what I've been doing. But obviously, people are obviously coming up to me and seeing that, oh, you're new because you've got your clothes on in here. Everyone's just naked. Everyone's naked. You're not going to boxer flex? Huh? I'm, I'm, I'm not there for that. And plus, I'm scared, you know, like, with what we do. Someone's like, oh, that's mix as well. Yeah. So yeah. I'm, let me, <laughs> it's boxes. Let me do like security. Dry right fire. Yeah, dry right fire exactly. and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. But Snoochie, some of those guys there, have made me feel a bit insecure because their tokoro is just shit. You know what I mean? Do you know what? How was your day? Wong, wong, uh, wong, 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 not to get involved, but Do you know just what? to. We are in tier four. Yeah, you, tier five. So, well, tier five. National yeah. lockdown. Yeah. So, I'm not sure if now's the right time. And I don't think after COVID is the right time either, because mm. there's going to be. What a lot of COVID like going around. Oh, oh gonorrhea. no, gonorrhea spike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's going to be a spike in gonorrhea. So. Yeah. No, but we're not going to be performing. We're going to just be watching. At a sex party and a gonorrhea spike, you'll probably be able to walk through the room <laughs> and absorb it is through it? your skin. <laughs> also, gonorrhea, is a new, there's a new one now coming out now. They reckon that after COVID, the amount of uh, sex that's going to happen is going to lead to a massive spike in gonorrhea. I think it's like 200% increase oh or something like that. All right, well, so all I'm saying is strap we'll go in five years. We'll go in if it's calmed down. We'll go in five years. The new up. gonorrhea is basically sex COVID. Is it? Yeah. Uh, Celibacy is waiting. Uh, you, you said you watched Arsenal highlights at one of those sex parties. Yeah. Europa League highlights. Yeah, and they were very, uh, very, very, very upset with me. <laughs> They want to talk to me about sex and then how I use Arsenal my. Lose. And I'm watching. I'm I'm watching Arsenal and I'm sending miles for voice notes. But it was a Do lot you, of activity. You go in there on your own. I went on my own. Yeah, but I, both, I went like three times now. I went a, a lot of activity. A lot of activity. Okay. Um, did you see that? Did you go there in a relationship? Yeah. With future person. Yeah, but remember, I, 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 like I said, I didn't go there to be get involved. I went in there the to research. look. And store, you know me. I'm a documentary. Yeah, yeah. I'm a serious conspiracy. Purposes. Yeah. So I went there to store, but you should do a documentary on sex parties. It's a serious. It's a. It's a. It's another world. Nah, I, I can assume it's probably very. It's late. another world. And you got to remember this swingers party. That means that if me and you are together, you're my wife. We've been married 25 years. 
I'm saying your boys have a turn. <laughs> that's a bit strange. I don't think you're no, you're, Sam, you're not in charge of her agency at that point. You've both gone together. She's yeah. saying boys She's have a saying, turn. She's saying let's get a crack in, yeah. and you're saying let's get a crack in as well. So you're just doing your own thing. You're not offering her. No. Out. <laughs> Obviously, you're going to have a conversation beforehand. Okay. Do you know what I mean, you're going to have a conversation beforehand. I don't know how it comes up, but it'll probably be like, look, we've been together for about five years. Should we go? Something new. Because a, a guy, shag. a guy, to, a guy bought his missus and asked me if I wanted to have a turn. What? Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. So. But that might be down to like I don't know. That coming, might be like another yeah, fetish. Yeah. Their communication as well, wouldn't it? Yeah, happens a lot. A lot of people love that. Mm. Also, people like some people like that's another fetish, isn't it? They like watching. Yeah. Mm. Their yeah, own yeah, yeah, yeah. Having sex, yeah. having a shag. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you think I'll ever watch my missus getting? Rumped by a Terminator and <laughs> with a leather jacket on. You'll probably start crying. So crying? Not, yeah. <laughs> You'll go and get a cat. So. Someone get an army here. I need a sniper. What is this? But it's interesting that you're going there then. Uh, do you know what? I'll be real snitchy. Something is, there's either something wrong with me or there's nothing right. <laughs> yeah? There's either something wrong or there's nothing right. My mind is somewhere else. So wherever I, Whatever I want to do, I'll just do it. But I make sure that there's still boundaries. I feel like I would go to one in a mask mm. um, to see what's going on as well. So I do get what you're saying. What, I would, a masquerade I probably one. Wouldn't, huh? One of those masquerade sex masquerade. parties. Yeah, I'd go, well, yeah. Snoochie, I imagine. wouldn't participate as well, but I'd go in there just to see what's going on. So I kind of feel your vibe there. But people will clock you. I'm I got clocked. I, got, I was wearing Kane's mask and someone said specs. On. They, was, they were clocked. They know. <laughs> They know. <laughs> they're sending you DMs. Right? They send you DMs down the They know. <laughs> they, 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 see these people that send you DMs, they know. You're, they see your shoulder by itself. That's Nucci. You me. must get that. Like, you'll, yeah. you'll, you'll see someone like, the other day I, I, I would take the rubbish out. I was out, out of the door for like half a second. Someone's riding a bike super fast. Man, man like Tigo. Like, <laughs> How? I've just set my arm in a, ba- a bin bag. They know. That they know. Jokes. They're fast. They know. This Let's next story, things. sorry, this next story is really Lumos should be here, but we're thankful he's not. It's from CBC. Stay downstairs! <laughs> this man owns $321 million in Bitcoin, but he can't access it because he lost his password. Stefan Thomas has <sighs> two guesses left. Two guesses left before he's locked out of his $321 million forever. Is he not got a forgot password? <laughs> I guess not. <laughs> I feel like a forgot password should be on there. You can re-access it again with an email address or maybe you can call up Bitcoin. You'd, <laughs> you'd imagine like if I just showed you my passport and just went, look, this is obviously me. I forgot my password. Yeah, Give man. me my 321 million. But they don't want to, man. They don't want to let that. What about the other guy as well? What is it that he's got 12 million in Bitcoin something and he lost it, he threw it away in the rubbish. Bin. Yeah, yeah. And so he's been that. asking the council or something, let me just go through the tip and find the 12 million, like a Willy Wonka ticket. Let me find that, 12 million Bitcoin. They're there, saying, no, mate. There was a man who accepted Bitcoin f- for a pizza. He ran a pizza shop and he said, all right, yeah, you can pay for it in Bitcoin. Never thought about it. And then like five years later, a millionaire because he took a Bitcoin for a pizza. The only Bitcoin I believe in is the coin you start taking off, you start ripping the skin off and inside is chocolate. <laughs> And that's the only Bitcoin I'll put my money in. Any other Bitcoin, it don't exist. You haven't got any Ethereum? T, again, I didn't go eating. I didn't play all them sports you did for PE. What does that mean, bro? <laughs> it's, it's, I don't a, know it's a kind of Bitcoin. That, that, listen, I've got people in the house that wake up to watch the trade market. And I have to raise my voice at 3am. It don't exist. Go to bed. <laughs> you can't decide. Everything you don't like doesn't exist. Oh, of course I can decide. It's my life. Of course I can decide that. <laughs> no one that. can tell him nothing. Oh, yeah. No kangaroos. <laughs> no Bitcoin. Yeah, I don't really understand the trading thing. A lot of people do it. Though. I see people tweeting about it all the time, like, tell sir. I don't get it, though. Snooze, do you know what it is? <laughs> do you know what it is? I if thought you... it was a car. Tell sir. Tell sir. <laughs> exactly. So they make exactly. films. Exactly. I don't know anything about it, and I can't drive either. I've tried to so fuck it. <laughs> Do you know what I hate? <laughs> <Fuck it>. Bitcoin <laughs> shit. Because I can't drive. <laughs> Do you know what I hate? Yeah. When someone comes and says, "Oh yeah, I, I made fifty k off Bitcoin," 
Is it bring me? Oh, it doesn't work like that. <laughs> You've got to study the game. Shut up, man. <laughs> you made the game. You made the game now. Do you know what I mean? It's always a different way for you. It doesn't exist. It don't exist. It actually man. doesn't exist. So if you, mm. I don't know. So so you say you put in thirteen pounds. This is obviously not real trading talk. And then you get fifty k. <laughs> this is not real trading talk. <laughs> real trading talk. Can you then just take the fifty k out? Then? Yeah, yeah. Straight away. Yeah, I, no... I, I think there's a time period, but I think it's minutes rather than like days. Oh, yeah. What's the difference between Grand National? You walk into a William Hill or a Ladbrokes or, or, or Betty Fred Ted, whatever you want to call that place. Yeah, yeah. What? The horse riding? The horse riding. Yeah. And you go and put £13 on horse, that's 100 to 1. How much you get? A couple grand. Mm. Same thing. You might as well do Grand National. That's, that's only once a year. No, it's, no, that's bro, your... it's 357 mil, isn't it? Yeah, like, yeah 321 mil. million. Dollars, yeah. You ain't getting that over a horse. That, that, that's, not, that, that's a lie. Horse racing, you're better <laughs> off because it exists. Bitcoin doesn't exist. Yeah, you're watching horses run. And the commentator, commentator flowing like millions. The value so of, so if you buy Bitcoin mm. for like five pound, right? Mm. The, yeah. the way the money goes up is more people want it. Mm. That's it. It doesn't exist. Is the heads on It's an closed? imaginary thing that you've bought for five pounds. But because Terry, Sherry, Steve and Carla all want it, it's mm. like, oh, well, now my five pound, I'm saying 12 pound. But can Terry, Steve, and Carla get that money can, out? Yeah, now? yeah, yeah. And yeah, it's yeah. a Bitcoin or it's yeah. real money? That's real money, yeah. Because oh. you're selling it, you're just so selling it, it on. Cash point. There are, there are <laughs> Bitcoin know. cash points, they do exist. Try, don't get yeah. involved there, trust me, don't get involved there. Lumos come here, Lumos has come here. Honestly, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to ruin his business now. <laughs> this no, guy. That's interesting, but. I don't this get guy, it. this guy called me, said, oh, Specs, who you got today? I said, huh? This is not Tigo, this is not Felix, Greg DFR, this is Lumos. What do you mean who I got today? Have you got no walls? I said, why? Because then I was going to come and check you. Said, mm, my spirit was up. So mm. I got Snoochie shy. He just appeared. Mm. So after this show, he's going to come to you and say, hey, Snoochie. Um, <laughs> you got money. <laughs> g- give me your phone. He's going to download an app called Elephants. <laughs> Elephants, you've got to type in, do all this stuff. He's going to do mad stuff on your phone. Don't do it. I ain't doing it. Snoochie, don't just say, it's not halal. Don't relapse. Oh, yeah. Don't, don't relapse. I've got an iPhone 8. It's not working. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah Lumos is going to show you still. <laughs> yeah, my Lumos is the plug. <laughs> yeah, boy. Come on. One last story. I feel like this is uh, a bit of you. This is a, a restaurant in Montreal. It's a Chinese restaurant mm. run by someone called Fei Gang Fei. And he, uh, his descriptions on the menu are very honest. I don't know if you saw this, it went viral. No, I haven't seen this. So he's got a dish here called beef and potato stew, or tu dao niu ru. And his description is, little, little spicy, more flavor of cumin, very tasty. We used to have beef pieces on small sticks, but several customers cut their lips by thinking it was some hard ingredient. Brackets, they must have watched some shows about weird Chinese food. To avoid incidents like this, no more sticks. Some good infusion from the overly fried onion slices, which you can eat. Definitely recommend this. I'd get it. That's an honest review. I'd get it. <laughs> he also has spare ribs with bamboo shoots, which in Chinese is, in Cantonese even, is sungan pai gu. I don't know how they pronounce their G's. He says, the intestines are fried. It's kind of too dry. Put me off already. Compared to stir-fried pork intestine, I recommend the former one. P.S. I changed my opinion now. I like both of them. <laughs> this on the menu? This is the menu description, yeah. I, I like this. I'll go for it. I probably wouldn't eat the intestine one, but I like the fact that he's being honest. There's a lot of liars out there. It's, it's working, apparently. People, people really like it. People really like the honesty, Just apparently. the truth. He says, mm. he says uh, about one of his dishes... Don't let the name fool you. This one is not authentic Chinese food. And he says, I'm not a huge fan of this one. (laughs) (laughs) Probably wouldn't get that one then. (laughs) But that is a no rules restaurant. That's definitely a no rules restaurant. That's that's how I eat. When we go restaurant and you say, Specs, do you want this? I ask you 10 million questions. Yeah. So he answers all those questions for me because I'm a very fussy eater. I love sad food. Well, I saw that breakfast. Yeah, so... (laughs) But, yeah, I like it. I'm trying to get my daughter out of it, though, because... I think, like, if if you've got a birthday party, we're best friends, and you've got a birthday party, he says, Specs, I'm going Lorokov. It's my favourite restaurant. Already, I'm like, shy, oh, man's got to do no rules with (laughs) Tigo. These times, Tigo's living in the country. (laughs) Because I don't like restaurants. 
Do you know what? I don't like I'm sitting there. I don't like, you know what I mean? All this food is just on the table. For me, that's just too much information. So what do you want? Like finger snacks? I like, like, I like going into cafes where you see a man working with his mum and dad. Mm. He's a young boy, he's working with his, you know what I mean? You sit down, you can see the bread chewing and all that stuff. But it's all basic. What about turkey dinosaurs? Because I do like to do an oven food Sunday sometimes. I'm coming after Sunday. After the roast. I'm coming Sunday. I love to, alphabetic chips. After the chips. roast. Algebra <laughs> chips, all that stuff. Give me all of that, man. <laughs> Give me all. I love Potato basic food. smiley faces. Pet- basic food. Do you know what needs to come back? Turkey Twizzlers. There we go. Basic come back. Food. I'm sure they're still about. No, they're not. You just don't go to Iceland. No, they're not you, about Your game is, is it? high now. No, what they've about, been discontinued. What about my, microchips? Sunny Delight came back. Microchips. Micro, no, I don't know. No, microchips. No, micro chips. Chips. <laughs> put the box in the yes. microwave. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Terrible. In a little box. Yeah. Yeah, and then crinkly. Yeah. Terrible. That's the food I like. I but like I never school dinners. Them, huh? I, just, I don't trust them ones. What, them microchips? Yeah. What was, the, what was the fish thing? Red and white. And you... Um, crab sticks. They're called crab sticks? Yeah, yeah, crab sticks. The red and white sticks. And you, you, you take the skin it off... back, like a cheese string. I don't Number know one. that. Yeah, I don't that's, no, that's a crab stick. That's yeah. how I eat. So crab stick, yeah? yeah? You eat like that as well? Yeah, yeah. So we, we're the same. I love a crab stick. We're the same, man. We, yeah. We're, not the same. We're identical. Well, I don't think you're the same. That restaurant would be banging if you had the basic stuff. This is a I think there needs chicken to be drama a from year seven's school dinner hall. <laughs> Bang! <laughs> That's what you I'm on. You should start a restaurant that just sells no information school dinners. There was something else. You know, oh, when mashed potato was like a when you finished mountain cake and custard. Oh, <laughs> cake, everyone loves cake and custard. Everyone Love that. It. No, no, no. But a cake ha- can't be have. It can't have like things inside the cake. No, no. that's not too much information. <laughs> a cake's got a dart in it, a little tennis ball, <laughs> apple. Like, what is all that stuff in the cake? I don't like that. It has to be to the sponge. Like, yeah. What about straight. icing, though? You don't even like icing on the cake? Yeah, you want icing. No, that's, that's cover. Why have we got cover on the cake? <laughs> <laughs> Why have we got cover? Do you know what I mean? <laughs> sprinkles. Hundreds of No, 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 no. The sprinkles, the... Actually, you know what I did like? The sprinkles in school with, that had, like, different colours. <laughs> Hundreds of thousands, yeah. Yeah, that, yeah, I like that sprinkle, but... Sprinkle cake. Oh, man, you're taking me back, man. Don't... Do you remember the beginning cake? of lockdown mm. when that, um, there was a big beef about those oh, yeah. school cakes? When those cakes people were off. selling them on yeah. oh. Instagram. Yeah. Anyway, Sprinkle cakes. that was no rule show. That was a classic. Oh, Snoochie, man. You're a G. I'm coming to your house on Sunday to have these algebra be... chips, blood. I'd, I've never seen algebra chips, but it will be like smiley faces, turkey twizzlers if they come back. We should get Jamie this. Oliver out of the way. T, we should film this. Me and Snoochie Shy... Having a big munch of like smiley faces, yeah. all yeah, of the yeah. all of the turkey dinosaurs. Don't forget that turkey don't dinosaurs, beans. mash because we fucking love beans. But it's got to be hind, no it's got to be hind beans. Hind beans, yeah, yeah. yeah. Don't um, go for any other beans. ketchup. Little drips of ketchup. No, on the top. I wouldn't have ketchup, but I'll have salad cream. <laughs> yeah, I'm a salad cream type of girl. Yeah, and we'll have like one like bucket of water. A bucket. Yeah. yeah. For chunks to come in and go to the toilet. And, the toilet and, the toilet and, and then have a wank. So, yeah. Snoochie, love for coming on. Um. Thank you. People, go me. and check out Snoochie on radio, man. It's a vibe. One extra. One extra. What days? Monday to Thursday. Shh, look at that, buff. <laughs> give her give her one day to sun, one day to Monday to Monday. No, thank so, you. That's hard work. Is it too much? It's hard work. No, yeah, it's lockdown though. I need some time off. Yeah, cool. yeah, I need to have a little break. Monday to Thursdays, people check her out, man. There's no rules. I'm following all platforms, man. Stucci Shy, the beautiful. She was here. There's no rules. Thank you can you. leave her feet alone. Who? If you're gonna message her. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't mind. I don't. If you're so I don't that's fine. Yeah. Oh yeah. If you, I mean, listen. If Stucci's rude, send it to me. Actually, I'm not talking about it. Don't send me no pictures, no your none of your feet. Man. Forget it. Oh, 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 o